My name is Elaine Shields and I'm a director with Ryan Hanley. Is that a business unit lead uh, for the water network flooding and environmental teams and commissions within our, our project portfolio. Um, at present, we have approximately 50% um, capacity in our offices uh, because of COVID, which means that at any point, uh, we have at least 50% of the company working from home. Um, we uh, have put steps in place to facilitate people who are uncomfortable returning to the office. Uh, certainly we have not made anybody or required anybody rather to uh, return to the office uh, with things uh, the way they are. Um, we haven't yet decided on what our, our working model is going to be going forward, um, but it is likely and certainly feedback from the company has been that some element of working from home um, would be uh, beneficial. Just the example of the most recent um, team building activity uh, that we offered was we had a company away day on the 5th of November. It was a combined um, team building activity and also an event to mark the company's 90th um, birthday. Ryan Hanley is 90 years old this year. Um, so uh, that event consisted of um, staff from all four of our offices being invited to attend um, at a hotel in Tullamore, central location. Um, and uh, we had team building activities like um, we had a digital treasure hunt. Um, we had various different uh, challenges. We had an event company in who, who organized and, and challenged us um, uh, to, to um, compete against each other. It was actually a bridge building challenge, which was quite interesting. Um, and um, uh, after that afternoon, we provided dinner and uh, accommodation for anybody who wished to uh, to wish to stay over. Um, like we, we really do feel that team building is it, it is very important. Um, we've had quite a number of new joiners um, to the company in the last year, in particular, and we really felt that with people spread out between home and between our four offices that we really needed an opportunity to bring everybody into the one space and allow them to um, have some time just to to try and bond to try and just meet face to face people who'd only ever spoken over teams of you know up to that point so it was a very successful event certainly feedback from it was uh, very successful all around there is a lot of collaboration within teams uh, within Ryan Hanley. Like we um, would always have prided ourselves on being a very collaborative working environment. Uh, a very uh, our, our entire business and, and, the, and the teams within it. Uh, certainly, uh, we aim to provide a space where everybody feels that they can voice their opinion. Um, that there's no such thing as a, as, as a stupid question or a question that shouldn't be answered. Um, that there is um, a safe space for um, people to actually contribute to the teams. Um, in addition to that, we have, you know, we're multidisciplinary. So we have our um, civil engineering teams, which would probably be the bulk of our um, our, our employees, but we have, um, you know, our, our structural team, we have our environmental team, we have a flooding team uh, within um, uh, the business and each one of those would often have cause to interact uh, together in terms of delivering a project from the client's concept uh, all the way through to um, handing them over the, um, the, the, the constructed scheme. So um, there is a lot of collaboration that's required throughout the project life cycle in order for that to happen. And it's something that I feel that we do very well here in Ryan Hanley. Most successful people at Ryan Hanley would be those who display um, ambition and certainly uh, those who show enthusiasm uh, toward what they do. Um, those who really, you know, show a drive to to, to, to learn, to, to grow professionally and to develop. Um, and, you know, if, 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 our, if people coming in provide all of those and provide the aptitude, we certainly feel that we provide the opportunity. We'll provide all the opportunities for them to, to develop. A lot of elements of, of my role that I enjoy. Um, I, even though I, I'm, I'm kind of more in a managerial role at the minute, my favourite part of the role would definitely be still the technical. And I'm fortunate in that I'm still able to uh, contribute technically uh, to some of the projects um, uh, on, my, on my current work list. So that, that's the part I really enjoy. Okay, um, well, employee input is, is highly valued in the company um, in relation to the, the mechanism of how we do it. It would be um, multifaceted. So we have um, surveys out on a, uh, a regular basis. Typically, those are done uh, by an anonymized uh, survey engine like SurveyMonkey, so that people can feel free to um, contribute. You know, things even you know if they if they want to be open and honest but may not be um, uh, happy um, uh, to put their name to it uh, there's still an opportunity for them uh, uh, to, to get their opinion out there um, we've also had um, 
um, a recent um, strategic, um, or sorry, workshops on the company strategic plan where all of our employees were invited in uh, over the course of three or four days uh, to look at um, where the company should target in the next five years, uh, what areas should we be looking at, where, we, where should we be looking to grow. Um, and um, all, like everybody who's attended, um, it was a workshop format where everybody's input was required you know um everybody was uh, w was given the opportunity to put their ideas on the table put them on the whiteboard um all out there for discussion um so like in terms of employee input we see that as as extremely important throughout um the the, the, the business um, and, and as the business continues to to grow um, originally i was attracted to ryan hanley because i had an interest in the water sector um, and Ryan Hanley are a kind of a specialist in the water sector in Ireland. Um, so I felt if that was an area that I wanted to grow in, a good company to work with was a specialist in that area um, that I could, um, uh, where I, obviously there were going to be people there who 